during meeting with China, Trump showed President Xi a surprise that made his jaw drop. President Donald Trump has several great things in the works sure to benefit America, and that's exactly why he's touring Asia at the moment. Most recently, he had a meeting in China, where he revealed a little surprise that he had brought along, and it was just enough to make Chinese President Xi Jinping's jaw drop straight to the floor. The left is on Trump pretty hard right now, regarding his remarks blaming former President Barack Obama for the relationship the U.S. has with China. Saying that Trump flip-flopped from his campaign remarks, liberals clearly don't understand that he's simply saying the same thing two different ways. For those unaware, he accused China of raping our country back in May of 2016, when referring to trade, which is a sentiment many find hard to argue with. However, as he most recently explained that it's Obama's fault, short-sighted liberals, like CNN, were quick to attack, claiming that he'd reversed course. Too bad for them, that is not true as both the statements are 100% true, and it's embarrassing for the morons with their pitchforks out today. After all, it's Obama's abysmal policies and trade agreements that allow China to rip us off every single day. It doesn't take a genius to see why a country would take advantage of a deal set forth if it benefits them. At the end of the day, if it hurts America, that really doesn't have an effect on China, and why wouldn't they want to spend less and get more? If the shoe was on the other foot, people would certainly understand this concept. Quite simply, it was Obama's responsibility to protect American interests while China's obviously going to do what's in their best interest. Essentially, Obama whored out the U.S., and the leftists are mad at Trump for calling him a pimp. Sadly, liberal morons don't get the connection and are even baffled to see Trump now being so kind to the people he once accused of raping us. Too bad for the left. Trump's desire to improve relations with China by being cordial is not going to stop no matter how much they fuss and whine. Proving just that, Trump decided to bring a little surprise along with him to his meeting with President Xi and revealed it moments after the two were seated. As it turns out, Trump's granddaughter was recorded in a video that left the Chinese leader's jaw on the floor. Trump proudly showed Chinese President Xi Jinping a video of his six-year-old granddaughter Arabella Kushner singing and reciting poems in Mandarin on Wednesday during a break between meetings. The video is now going viral in both China and the world. Amazingly, Arabella dedicated the video to Grandpa Xi and Grandpa Peng. Jinping was delighted while watching the video and told President Trump that he graded the performance in A+. Arabella the daughter of Ivka Trump has been learning Mandarin from her Chinese nanny since she was an infant. At the end of the day, this was an incredible exchange, but I doubt that it will get any real mainstream media coverage whatsoever, at least, not from networks like CNN and MSNBC and not with the praise it deserves. What we have here is a man capable of reaching out and getting things done no matter how bad the situation was when he was handed the job, but for whatever reason, the left would rather he fail than recognize and credit him with any success, even when it's what's best for our country. Trump is making America great again, and the leftists in this country may want to hold on to their seats because it's going to be a bumpy ride for them if that's not something they can appreciate. As for the idiots out there who can't see that good things are in the works, well, their failure to comprehend common sense says more about them than it does about President Trump. Ignoring the truth simply because it hurts your narrative doesn't do anyone any favors and is the reason that things aren't progressing as quickly as they should. Liberals need to pick their battles because, at this point, they're showing off just how dumb they are with crap like this, like this.